Chairs, tables, couches piling up in alleys across South St. Louis. Tonight, neighbors in one community tell News 4 they are fed up with illegal dumping. Good evening, I'm Courtney Bryant. I'm Steve Savard in for Claire Kellett. That problem is frustrating residents. News 4's Emma Hogue is asking the city about their concerns. She's live tonight from the Bevo Mill neighborhood. Emma? Steve and Courtney, aside from these tires back behind me tonight, this area is pretty clear, but neighbors say this is rare. They're used to seeing things like mattresses and couches piling up right in front of their garage doors. And despite cameras and signs, they say this problem is only getting worse. Every time I open up this door, you really have no idea what's going to be behind that door. On a weekly basis, Alex Turman says it's typically huge pieces of furniture. Couches and mattresses, tables, chairs, full furniture sets out in the in the alley blocking our garage. She blames illegal dumpers, the trash pile making it difficult, if not impossible, to get her car out. A full couch, we've had wood pallets. Um, a swing set was here yesterday in front of our house. Neighbors in Bevo Mill say this problem has plagued the area for months. I'm going to show you my alley real quick. Some even took to a neighborhood group sharing these pictures. Video shows two people dumping construction materials just the other day. It's at least once a week. Neighbors say they've called the city multiple times but can't get a clear answer. We shouldn't have to call two or three times to get something picked up. I mean, it's getting ridiculous. So News 4 reached out to the city to get answers and found out illegal dumping is on the rise across the metro. We're told the quickest way to get help is to file a complaint online through the Citizen Service Bureau. The Trash Task Force says it responds to each complaint as quickly as it can. It could take at least three days or, or longer. But for neighbors like Terman, it's not soon enough. Tonight, she's working to install cameras of her own. When someone is dumping something out here, that we can see who's doing it and do something about it. Now, city officials say they've installed more than 100 cameras around the metro, hoping to crack down on this problem. But again, the easiest thing to do is to file a complaint online. We have information on how to do that on our website, KMOV.com. Reporting live in Bevo Mill tonight, Emma Hogue, News 4.